Hi my lovelies, I hope you're all well. So today I'm going to show you how you can select multiple layers in the iOS app. So that's iPhone or iPad. So I've got an image here and the first thing I can do is use my canvas to select my layers. So I can either click on it or I can draw around it using my finger. However, because it's all grouped together, when I do that, it selects all of my layers. So you can see nothing selected. My layers are all white. If I click on the image, those layers will all turn a darker gray. Now I can use my layers panel to select an individual layer just by clicking on it. And you'll see when I click on it, it turns a darker gray. And if I click on one and keep my finger on it and select another, it will allow me to select two layers at a time. And I could then, of course, if I wanted to change the colors on those and it would change the color on both of them. Now, if I want to select those using my canvas, I'm going to have to ungroup it. So if we select the whole image and go to actions, we can ungroup and you'll see that the orange part of our pumpkin is now ungrouped from everything else, but everything else is still grouped together. So again, if we click on that set of layers, we can ungroup those. Now each of our layers are individual, so we can select them. However, because the way that the image is set up, this teal layer here dominates these two layers of pumpkin, these two kind of amber layers. So the only way I can select them at the moment is to actually use my layers panel. So what I can do is I can select that teal layer and at the bottom of my layers panel, I've got the hide icon. I can hide that and it will then allow me to use my canvas to select the other layers. And I can, of course, by clicking on it in my layers panel, bring back that other layer. Equally, if I hide some of my other layers, I can then use my fingers to select multiple layers at once. And of course, I can use the layers panel to hold one and select another at the same time. Being able to do this means that I can change colors, I can do offsets on specific layers, I can attach only two or three layers together so they're all the same. Like I can do so much being able to ungroup and then select multiple layers. And of course, once I'm happy, I can bring back my hidden items. As always, I hope this has been really helpful to you. If you've got any comments or questions, please do leave them below and I'll see you all again very soon. Bye.